Trouble has again hit the campaign trail of ultra-conservative Senator Fraser Anning, a brawl breaking out between a supporter and a news photographer. The Anning fan took offence when reporters grilled the Senator over his statements about immigration. Fraser Anning spreading his far-right message in Cronulla. Sudanese gangs who are attacking people on a daily basis. It was always a recipe for trouble. And trouble there was. The man with the ripped T-shirt is a news photographer. His alleged attacker is Max Towns, a proud Anning supporter, still smiling even after he'd been placed under arrest. The pot started stirring when the Queensland senator introduced his candidate for the electorate of Cook. As you know, this area is the uh, Prime Minister's seat and uh, there's been all sorts of problems here with um, uh, the Muslim immigrants who have come in here and uh, attack people here, right here where we're standing now. A reference to the race riots 14 years ago. Video journalist Andrew Leeson was filming the event and says supporters took issue with policy questions. I, mean, I just caught uh, someone make a comment to a journalist as they passed by. Uh, the journalist asked them what they said. The, the gentleman kept walking. Um, and then as the photographer chased after him, uh, he reaches out and grabs a camera. It's the second outbreak of violence following the Egg Boy drama last month. People should be able to go to work, whether you're a photographer or anyone else, and not be subjected to that sort of violence. Unlike the previous egging incident, police here have laid charges of assault and intimidation. Max Towns will have to explain himself in court on the 16th of May. The 19-year-old dodged the cameras and questions, now keeping his cool. Tiffany Genders. Would you like to apologise? Nine News. Queensland is watching the number one news hour.